Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches, so your discretion is advised. We kill shit here. What's up guys? I want to do something different for you guys right now. I'm going to try to catch crawfish out of this pond. We're going to put uh, hot dogs in the traps. We're going to throw them back in and we're going to see how many we can get and we're going to do a cook. So Here's what I got. I got a couple small ones. There's a big one. I had it out here on the deck but it blew in. <clears throat> so I got to get in there and grab him out. We'll put, We'll probably put the big one back here. Chop a little one somewhere on that corner. Put another one on that corner. I don't know what kind of uh, repopulation I'm going to have because of the bluegill. There's some pretty big bluegill in here now. But I've seen some big crawdads earlier. They're, under, they're up here getting food. So we know they're in here. I just need to get some out and have a, have a nice cook. So that's what we're going to do. And I'm going to grab this one out here real quick. Still a little cold. Still a little chilly, boys. We'll get this guy out. I, I was, I put it in and I caught a pile of bluegill and a pile of uh, freaking goldfish. So nothing in there. Nothing. But we'll, what we'll do is we'll get that re reset back up. See if I can't find one here for you guys. Usually under all these rocks we got crawl pads. Right here. I see one right here. I don't know if you guys will be able to see him or not. Can I move this rock? There's a big boy right there. Look at that big boy. Oop. He's like, I'm out. Oh, look at this big boy right here. Look at that. Oh, oh yeah? You wanna fight me, huh, boys? Probably heads in a barrel, apparently. <laughs> so there we got. Here's what we're after. We just gotta get them in my belly. So there is what we're gonna be eating, boys. Crawfish. They're all over in here, so see how many we can get. Okay, a few more hot dogs in here. Hopefully it'll roll down and there we go. Now we'll put another one over here. If I can get it to fall down through these lily pads. These lily pads are <clears throat> pretty strong. We're going in. We're going in, boys. We're in there. That's a pretty cool flower right there. All right, now we'll get the big one put together and we'll lay it down here on the bottom. I don't know, we'll see. Probably be in the fall now. Okay. Some of you might be wondering how these work, and I'll show you that right now.
crawfish finds his way up here. He's looking for bait. He's gonna be he's gonna be stubborn at the moment because he's grabbing on everything. But they find the bait. They go in, and they are stuck in there. Can't get back out unless they're smart and they find a way to climb through that hole. But most times they don't. They'll still be in there. But he thinks he's free and he's cruising across to the other side. But I'll put some bait in here. I don't know if it matters if it's broken up or not. It usually doesn't, but. Where's my dog? She's soaking wet and she really wants a treat. Sit, Molly, sit. Sit. There you go. You get some of them. Okay, well, let's get this in and we'll be in business. Obviously, we already have a crowd out in this one. Hot dogs tend to float, it looks like. And put it right there. Let's see how she goes. I'm assuming we'll just climb right up on it. We'll have it. All right, guys. Well, we'll check it in the morning and see if we catch anything. We should. We definitely know we got one anyway, so stay tuned. What's up, guys? It's the next day. Uh, everybody's hungry. I see we got some bluegill in there. At least it looked like it earlier. Looks like it might be a couple goldfish in there. Bluegill goldfish will go in this container i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with the crawdads yet i gotta keep them somewhere in the shade so came out here last night shine a light and there were crawdads all along the top here so we might jump in take out all these rocks gotta take them out anyway so i might dig them out get the crawdads out of them if i can catch them that'd be kind of fun i need to take the rocks out anyways because we're gonna be redoing some stuff so We'll get this one first. See what we got. Two, three. Something fell. Three jumbos in there. And those are eaters there. Sheesh. As long, long as they don't have eggs, we will eat them. Those are big ones. Wow. Let's get these guys out. Three good ones there. Sheesh. They ate the shit. Look at this guy. You dinner boy. You dinner boy. Here's another one. Big guy. And we got a smaller one, but he's big enough. We're not gonna put him back. Come on, let go, let go. You guys remember we got? Ah! Son of a bitch! You guys remember we have uh, for sure one in there that we put in there. Let's go get this other one out here. Let's see what we got. Four in this one, five in this one maybe? Sweet, a couple small ones though that we'll turn into bait. We'll put them in the old bait bucket. <clears throat> no goldfish yet, and it's really surprising. That's very surprising to me. Another one pincher, no eggs, she's done. Little guy, good bait right there. We'll take him down to a local bait shop and let him have them. Another girl there. Is this eater? I think this one's probably eater. I think you guys have to let me know. Might as well. 
Might as well keep this one to eat. It's pretty good size. I mean, it's a more of a fishing one. Eh, let's put him in this one. Eh, yeah, I think he's an eater. I don't know for sure. I got this guy. He's a he's a piece of bait. Let's pull this big one out of here and see if we got any good ones in there. We know we got one in there, unless he got out. At least one goldfish, I can just see. We got goldfish, boys. Goldfish for days. How did we not catch? We got goldfish, though. We're going to try to use these goldfish to catch uh, some crappie. Since we're catching them, might as well use them. Or bass fishing. That's the plan, anyway. We're going goldfish. They ain't happy. Got one bluegill. Oh, there's more in here than I thought there was. Whew, we got a big daddy in here. Sheesh! Look at that guy. Sheesh! Oh, you dummy. <laughs> he tried to get me. There's three crawdads in here. One we put in, obviously. That guy we did not. He's a big one. And then we got a bluegill. He's gonna be bait. Little, little guy. go Get them guys chilling there so here's what we got one two three four five six seven eight eaters so far put them in the shade here then we're gonna hop in here and see if we can't find a few more Oh, I see whiskers there. Nobody can hide under that rock, apparently. Oh. I just saw a microscopic one. We got babies, boys. I don't know how they're surviving with the bluegill in here. But I just seen a itty bitty baby. Somebody did bit my toe. I don't like that one bit. Nobody here? There's one right here. I don't really want to tear all that out to get him. Found a pincher. It's pretty dirty there. That's good, I'll get it to go into the filter. We'll stir it up some. Nobody there. come out and find you guys a baby that's cool that there's some babies in here there's a shell throw that out we don't get much rain it seems like anymore so I gotta add water to the pond usually the rain will add it to it with the gutter system but Well, I bet you that tree is uh, sucking my water out of here. 
I didn't realize that tree was that big. I'll bet you that is rooted in. It's probably a pretty good chance of it. I'll go plant it in the yard somewhere. Some of the bitches. Too smart for me. Apparently. Now I just saw him come back in. Son of a bitch. You ain't that smart. I got you now. Son of a bitch. I want to get you one of them small ones. There he is. To get a net. Here we go. Oh. Look at that. Itty bitty guy right there. Itty bitty crowd ad. There's quite a few of them. 